lesson, we're going to talk about American English idioms. Are you ready? Let's begin. Here's an idiom for you. Beat around the bush. Have you heard that one before? Beat around the bush. What do you think that means? Well, let me tell you. It simply means get to the point. If you're talking to someone, don't go around and around talking about other things, trying to get to the point, delaying what you have to say. Just say it. If you go to your boss and you ask for a raise, ask for the raise. Don't talk about all kinds of other things. Oh, what great work I've been doing. I love this company. Oh, you're such a great boss. Get to the point. Sir, ma'am, I've been working here for XXX. I think I deserve more money. I would like a raise. I'm requesting a raise. Don't beat around the bush. What's a bush? Well, look behind me. You see some trees and you see some bushes. They're like little short trees, right? Bushy. Don't beat around the bush. Get to the point. Twenty twenty hindsight. Have you heard that one? Twenty twenty hindsight. What does that mean? Well, if you have very good vision, the eye doctor, the optometrist, is going to tell you that you have twenty twenty vision. That means you can see very well. You don't need glasses. Now, hindsight means hind, behind, sight, see in the past, to look into the past, right? It means 2020 hindsight. Hindsight is 2020. That means if you look in the past, you can see everything clearly, right? So if you make a decision today and it doesn't work out, you don't know that until you get into the future and you look into the, your hindsight. You use your hindsight and you can see with 2020 clarity that you shouldn't have done that. Or, hey, that was a pretty good decision. I'm glad I did do that. 2020 hindsight, you can see clearly in the past, right? Well, with 2020 hindsight, I can see that I should have bought those stocks or I shouldn't have bought those stocks. I should have taken that job, or I shouldn't have taken that job. But at the time you make the decision, you don't know that. All you can do is hope you're making the right decision, but later on, it's obvious if you did make the right decision. Does that make sense to you? I think it does. 2020 hindsight. Hindsight is 2020. Hold your horses. To hold your horses. What does that mean? Do you have a horse? Are you, are you going to hold the horse? What are you doing with this horse? Hold your horses simply means to wait. Don't decide on something too fast. Don't move forward too quickly with some sort of a decision. Probably a decision. Not really something physical like a movement, but a decision. Like perhaps you're You've made plans that you're going to move to another city because of your new job, but you haven't gotten your new job yet. So why are you, why are you moving to the city? What if you don't get the job? Hold your horses. Wait, wait. That's all we're saying. Wait, hold your horses. Pull back on those reins. Hold the horses like in an old American Western movie where they have a team of horses pulling a wagon, you pull back on the reins to hold your horses back. Don't make a decision too fast. Hold your horses.